Today, I'm gonna to show you how you can estimate the age of any oak tree using a simple math equation. Science shows us a direct correlation between the size of an oak's trunk and its age. The first step is to measure its circumference or the distance all the way around its trunk. Now, if you don't have a flexible measuring tape like me, you can always use a piece of string or yarn, mark your circumference and measure it out later using a ruler or a rigid measuring tape. So first step, we're going to see where exactly is four and a half feet off the ground on this beautiful coast live oak. It's about right here. I'm gonna measure all the way around this tree. About 45 and a half inches in circumference. So you wanna take your circumference measurements, 45 and a half, and divide it by pi 3.14 in order to get the diameter, 14.5 inches. And the diameter is the distance directly from one side straight through to the other. The next equation that you need to do is to multiply your diameter by the growth factor of your tree. And when we're talking about growth rate, we're talking about how much that diameter grows each year, or essentially how much bigger the trunk gets each year. Now, trees grow at different rates depending on the type of resources available to them. So generally, trees growing in forests will grow a bit faster than trees growing in cities. So each species of oak has its own particular growth rate. So if you haven't already, you're gonna need to identify what species of oak you're working with. This here is a coast live oak. And I know that based on the shape of the leaves and the shape of the acorns. I also really like to use a free app on my phone called iNaturalist, where I can snap a picture of any plant and upload that photo to find a match to the species. Most oaks in California have a growth factor of three, four, or five with three being a much faster growing oak and five being a slower growing oak. If you can't find the growth factor for your species, go ahead and use four. That tends to be the best average middle of the road growth factor for any oak. For this coast live oak, I'm also going to be using four. So we need to multiply our diameter by our growth factor. So this beautiful coast live oak here is about 58 years old. Isn't that incredible? I hope you enjoy getting to know the oaks in your community a bit better using this fun activity. Thanks for watching.